The Septuagint, Psalm 89 I will sing of thy mercies, O Lord, forever. I will declare thy truth with my mouth to all generations. For thou hast said, Mercy shall be built up forever. Thy truth shall be established in the heavens. I made a covenant with my chosen ones. I swear unto David my servant. I will establish thy seed forever, and build up thy throne to all generations. Selah. The heaven shall declare thy wonders, O Lord, and thy truth in the assembly of the saints. For who in the heavens shall be compared to the Lord, and who shall be likened to the Lord among the sons of God? God is glorified in the counsel of the saints, great and terrible toward all that are round about him. O Lord God of hosts, who is like to thee? Thou art mighty, O Lord, and thy truth is round about thee. Thou rulest the power of the sea, and thou calmest the tumult of its waves. Thou hast brought down the proud as one that is slain. And with the arm of thy power thou hast scattered thine enemies. The heavens are thine, and the earth is thine. Thou hast founded the world, and the fullness of it. Thou hast created the north and the west. Tabor and Hermon shall rejoice in thy name. Thine is the mighty arm. Let thy hand be strengthened. Let thy right hand be exalted. Justice and judgment are the establishment of thy throne. Mercy and truth shall go before thy face. Blessed is the people that knows the joyful sound. They shall walk, O Lord, in the light of thy countenance. And in thy name shall they rejoice all the day, and in thy righteousness shall they be exalted. For thou art the boast of their strength, and in thy good pleasure shall our horn be exalted. For our help is of the Lord, and of the Holy One of Israel, our King. Then thou spokest in a vision to thy children, and saidest, I have laid help on a mighty one. I have exalted one chosen out of my people. I have found David my servant. I have anointed him by my holy mercy. For my hand shall support him, and mine arm shall strengthen him. The enemy shall have no advantage against him, and the son of transgression shall not hurt him again. And I will hew down his foes before him, and put to flight those that hate him. But my truth and my mercy shall be with him, and in my name shall his horn be exalted. And I will set his hand in the sea, and his right hand in the rivers. He shall call upon me, saying, Thou art my Father, my God, and the Helper of my salvation. And I will make him my firstborn, higher than the kings of the earth. I will keep my mercy for him forever, and my covenant shall be firm with him. And I will establish his seed forever and ever and his throne as the days of heaven. If his children should forsake my law, and walk not in my judgments, if they should profane my ordinances, and not keep my commandments, I will visit their transgressions with a rod, and their sins with scourges. But my mercy I will not utterly remove from him, nor wrong my truth. Neither will I by any means profane my covenant, and I will not make void the things that proceed out of my lips. Once have I sworn by my holiness that I will not lie to David. His seed shall endure forever, and his throne as the sun before me, and as the moon that is established forever, and as the faithful witness in heaven. Selah. But thou hast cast off and set at naught. Thou hast rejected thine anointed. 
Thou hast overthrown the covenant of thy servant. Thou hast profaned his sanctuary, casting it to the ground. Thou hast broken down all his hedges. Thou hast made his strongholds a terror. All that go by the way have spoiled him. He has become a reproach to his neighbors. Thou hast exalted the right hand of his enemies. Thou hast made all his enemies to rejoice. Thou hast turned back the help of his sword, and hast not helped him in the battle. Thou hast deprived him of glory. Thou hast broken down his throne to the ground. Thou hast shortened the days of his throne. Thou hast poured shame upon him. Selah How long, O Lord, wilt thou turn away forever? Shall thine anger flame out as fire? Remember what my being is, for hast thou created all the sons of men in vain? What man is there who shall live and not see death? Shall anyone deliver his soul from the hand of Hades? Selah Where are thine ancient mercies, O Lord, which thou swearest to David in thy truth? Remember, O Lord, the reproach of thy servants, which I have borne in my bosom, even the reproach of many nations. Wherewith thine enemies have reviled, O Lord, wherewith they have reviled the recompense of thine anointed. Blessed be the Lord forever. So be it. So be it.